guys welcome back okay so today um we just gonna put some makeup on as usual <laughs> but i do want to play around with this palette that i ordered during the whole black friday craze or whatever bombshell cosmetica came out with this new sourlicious palette and it's another super colorful bright palette from them and this is what it looks like so and it it smells like a sour patch kid <laughs> it smells like candy but this is what it looks like it says smell me but do not lick me up there by the mirror and these are the colors for this palette so just another bright colorful palette that I didn't need as you can see the first and third rows are all mattes and the middle section are all shimmers so very pretty bright colorful palette and I'm not sure what I'm gonna do today but I am going to play and have some fun so let me go ahead and swatch this so we can see what's happening I don't know you guys my coffee has not kicked in this morning I don't know what's going on, but if I seem like I'm dragging a little bit, it's because I am. <laughs> So these are all the matte shadows. I'm gonna go over just a few of them um, for a set. I mean, they swatch pretty decent, actually. I went over the blue a second time because the swatch wasn't that great, but they actually swatch pretty decent. So these are all the mattes. Let me go over this blue one more time. So that's just a second swatch for that blue. This color here is kind of like a brown shade. Not really brown. I don't know how to describe it. It's kind of like a it's kind of like a warm toffee shade or something. Nice transition. But the matte swatch pretty decent. Okay, these shimmers did not come to play, you guys. Do you see that? Whoa. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm like, I'm in shock right now off of these shimmers. Whoa. Okay, so this is the whole palette, you guys. Not bad. <laughs> Okay, you guys, so before I get started, I need to prep my lids. So I'm going to use my MAC Soft Ochre Paint Pot to prep my eyelids today. Okay, you guys, so I think I'm going to use tape today so I don't really have to worry about, you know, where I'm putting my eyeshadow <laughs> on the outer corners. I'm just going to use tape. Okay. I usually don't get my tape even, but that's what we're working with today. Okay. So, so many pretty colors. Where to start? Um, okay. I think I'm going to start with this purple shade up here, which is called Wild Cherry. Interesting. Not sure why purple is called wild cherry, but we're gonna go into wild cherry. Okay, so this color is very pretty, nicely pigmented. Smells like candy. <laughs> Very pretty. 
Okay, next I'm gonna go into this shade down here, this beautiful blue. And I think that says plum. Y'all know my vision. But yeah, I'm gonna go into this one here. And I'm just kind of tapping this color down on the edge of that purple before I start to blend because I don't want it to disappear. So this blue is laying down nicely with that purple, but I am having to go in and just build it up and make sure that it's nice and opaque. But it looks very pretty. Okay guys, so now that I have this purple and blue down, and I really like how those two colors are looking together. I'm like, okay, girl, what in the world are you gonna do with your cut crease? Not sure. I'm kind of feeling the gold, the orange, and the purple. So that's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna cut my crease with some of my Revolution Cut Crease Canvas. Okay guys, so that cut crease is going to have to be close enough to even for these eyes. Right now I'm just kind of tapping off some of that excess product from the cut crease canvas because it does crease while you are just kind of farting around trying to figure out what you want to do. So I'm just going to try and tap some of that off. And I think I'm gonna work from the outside in. So I'm going to go into the dark purple shimmer and put that on the outside. And since it's swatched so well, I'm gonna try and do it without spraying my brush first, just cause I'm curious. Okay, we got pigment. I can't get over how these shadows smell. They smell just like candy. <laughs> just like candy. Okay, now I'm gonna take this orange shimmer here. And I really wanna use these colors because they just swatched so beautifully. <laughs> that I have to see how they look on my eyes. Okay, so this one I'm going to try and spray because it's not popping off like the purple did. Okay, so that's better with the spray. This orange actually seems to me like one of those shadows where I would like how it looks placed down without any cut crease, without any cut crease canvas. You know, sometimes you just do your matte shades and then put your shimmers, you know, on your lid. Yeah, this is one where I probably just put it on without any cut crease canvas underneath it. It's beautiful though. You guys, I'm loving this orange, it's so pretty. Okay, so on the inner portion, I'm going to place this pretty gold shimmer. And I'm gonna go ahead and just spray my brush for this one. And 
just blending it into that orange. Okay, you guys, I'm not even going to lie. These shimmers are really pretty. They are really sha-popping on my lids, okay? I don't know if it's going to come through on camera, but they are pretty. Okay, so let me take this tape off so I can figure out what I'm going to do. I think I'm going to do a black liner. Okay, now back to these eyes. I'm gonna go ahead and do a purple eyeliner. So this is one of my ColourPop gel eyeliners. Okay, so since I really, really like this blue, I'm gonna take some of this blue on my lower lash line, and then I really wanna try out this green shimmer, so I think I'm going to put that on my inner corner. And I'm just using a flat brush to tap this down on my lower lash line because I found with this blue it shows up better when you just kind of tap it instead of trying to blend it out I really like that blue I kind of don't want to mess it up with adding green but I'm curious as far as how this green is going to lay down so we're going to use the green Okay, that's pretty. It's really pretty. It's kind of like a mint green, so it's not a dark green at all. So I'm gonna throw on some mascara and we'll come back and figure out a lip. Okay, you guys, I'm not really sure as far as what to do with lips for an eye look like this. So I'm gonna do like a combination of some things. This is my ColourPop and Ellery lip liner, of course. This is one of my Juvia's Place matte lipsticks. It's really, really pretty purple color. And then this is um, my Fenty lip gloss from the Galaxy collection a while ago, long time ago. And so I'm gonna put this on top, I think. Okay, guys, so let me take off this headband, put on some earrings or something, make myself look cute, and I'll be right back to talk about this palette. Okay, a little Morphe setting mist. Okay, you guys, so first impression thoughts on this Sourlicious palette. I think it's a very nice palette i mean the colors are very vibrant nicely pigmented they blend it out well together i would say you know for this blue it definitely worked out better for me with the packing motion as opposed to windshield wiper motion so yeah just for that blue the purple worked out absolutely fine for tapping it or blending it and the pigmentation is really, really nice. These shimmers, all I can say is they are gorgeous. <laughs> These shimmers are so bomb in this palette. I really, really like them. I like how they lay down on top of the cut crease canvas. The orange, like I said, I actually want to play with that 
without any base down. All of the shimmers actually without a base because I feel like they would lay on my lid perfectly fine without any type of cut crease canvas. So I do want to play around with those more, but just for the shadows I used today to create this look, I like this palette so far. I don't have any complaints. It's swatched nicely. It's nicely pigmented. It smells like candy. <laughs> so yeah, that's just my first impression thoughts on this, you guys. Of course, you know, I have to use it more to see if there's any duds in here, but I like the look it created. It's very vibrant and colorful, so I'm happy with it. I had a lot of fun playing with it today. Hopefully you guys had fun hanging out with me today to create this look, and thanks so much for watching. Make sure you hit like if you're not subscribed. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button, and I will see you on my next video. Toodles!